Hey, <laughs> Mark Rice here, and today I want to try to record a video just for myself. And I know it can be crazy a bit, so don't worry about me. I'm okay. Okay, so today we will draw cat and first hit M on the keyboard. So, first I will draw the basic shape of the head with the rectangle. And pick up the yellow color. Make these corners round. And that's it, now we have the cat. So, see you in the next tutorial. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Okay, first I will copy the shape and make here a beautiful shadow. Move up the copied shape and copy it again the basic shape. Ctrl C, Ctrl F. Change the color a bit. Something like this. Okay. Then select the copy and shapes and use minus front tool in the pathfinder. I will draw the ears. Okay. Create one more, I don't know, square maybe. Here. Then select the pen tool and delete this point here. Okay. Hit A on the keyboard and make this corner round. Something like this. Okay, beautiful. Now I have the ear. And I will move the shape here, send to back, copy the shape, move it here, reflect it. Okay. And hit OK. Maybe it can be more interesting if I leave the ears like that. We will see. Okay, beautiful. Beautiful, so we need the beautiful eyes. Hit L on the keyboard, draw the circle. Okay, copy the shape, change the size and use the black color for the new shape. Hold Alt, then Shift and move it here. Okay, I just created the eyes, but if you want to achieve beautiful eyes, just hold Shift plus Alt and change the size. Okay, now it's beautiful. After the eyes, I will draw the nose. So, hit M on the keyboard, meow, and draw the rectangle tool. I will use orange color for it. Okay, make these corners round. And here I will create a shadow as well. Okay, copy the shape, something like this. Here I will create one more rectangle for a beautiful glow. Okay. I finished this part of the nose, so I will group the shapes. Okay, cool. And here I will show you the most beautiful part of the nose or of the mouth. I don't know. You need to draw the rectangle. Okay. Here swap fill and stroke. Okay, and change the stroke size. Something like this. Select these points and make these corners round. Then select the pen tool with P on the keyboard and delete this point here. Okay, double click on it. Select this line and hit delete. Go here into stroke and cup needs to be rounded. Something like this. Okay. You can go into object, then path and use outline stroke. Now I created the object from the outline. I can change the size, copy the shape, reflect it by vertical and move it here. I think that I created the mouth, not the best part of the nose. <laughs> but it's beautiful and this is the purpose of the tutorial. Okay, here I will create one more rectangle like this. Okay, it will be rounded rectangle. Rotate it by 45 degrees, move it here and copy it. Okay. And second will be here. And here I can create one more. 
something like this. Okay, copy the shapes, rotate it, and move it here. Oh, I don't like this part. It's like a Christmas tree. Okay, I think that it's better, but I can improve it a bit. Okay, that's it. I like it. Now it's much better. So, this is how you can transform Christmas tree to the cat. <laughs> now the body. Draw the rectangle here. I'll use the color from the head. Okay. Maybe I can change the size of the body. Something like this. Okay. Copy the shape, rotate it by 180 degrees, move it here and change the color. This will be the shadow. Okay, then select these shapes and use the wide in the pathfinder. Ungroup it and delete this part here. Group it and that's it. Here I will draw one more rectangle. Make these corners round. And send to back. Okay, cool. I like the yours, but I will move this shape here. <laughs> oh man. I will try the last option. Okay, I like it. I think that I got it. Okay, cool. Now the tail. So, it will be very easy. First hit P on the keyboard, hold shift and draw the line. Something like this. Okay. Then make these corners round and this one as well. Okay, beautiful. Swap fill to stroke. Change the size of the stroke. Okay, cool. Go into stroke. And select rounded cup into the stroke. Okay, move it here, send to back, okay, and now I can add a cool detail here, so I'll copy the line, control plus C, control plus F, delete these points here, okay, and I will use darker color a bit. Okay, like this. Beautiful, I like it. Select the shapes and uh, use outline stroke. Okay, now I need a semicircle. Okay, I got my semicircle. And change the color. I need white for it. Okay. Copy the shape. Okay, I like it, it's beautiful. And if you want to improve your cat, you can add a texture here. So I'll use the shadow color for it. And go here. Okay. And select round rectangle tool. And then you can draw the rectangles. And it will be beautiful texture for the cat. Something like this. Okay, here as well. And I will create a shadow. It will be gray with rounded corners. And I will send to back. And that's it for today. Stay tuned because the best is yet to come. Peace. In a city full of sound